so that he can go for the wide one as well. See this one already, he's he's making Pete guess where it's going. He'll also want to be jamming into the Sampras body on second serve. Oh, yeah. There's that wide one again. He did effectively against Lendl. The offensive lob, a little topspin. Sampras gets his racket on it, can't do anything with it. Then good preparation. Watch it get ready with that racket. That's the key. If you look at the ball and get the racket ready. Average at the net here by Sampras. Good long reach. He was setting up just to the left of the center line far left, looking for the down the line, and he was right. But then he got plenty on it. From the corner. Yeah. Yeah. Game, Game Sampras. Sampras. If it doesn't, Sampras will try to take advantage of it. <laughs> McEnroe's second serve. Good one. Had a lot of bite on it. This one close to the baseline. Sanford's had a look at the lines person after the point. And he does a great job here. John makes a good smash. Didn't direct it real well. Couldn't handle the low volleys. Oh, boy. This is He's missed uh, some first serve zone. That's cost him. Again, goes right down the tee, right to the forehand side. You almost have to give them. the judge. Watch the good touch on the backhand angle volley. Very natural player at the net. He moves very well, covers. Maryland beat West Virginia, Tennessee looking strong over Mississippi State. In direction, watch Sampras's racket right here. He doesn't take it back very far. He just holds it about right by his hip. A very talented player. Penetrate Sampras. He's missing. This is well inside the baseline and just cranks up on this forehand. And that really was hit with a lot of pace. Here's another look. He's inside. He coils the upper body. Got over the top of the.
difference. Ball change. Okay. Off the court. Now that was a second serve clock at 105. Look at John. <laughs> Have another look. This is the second serve now. Max thing about maybe I'll take it early and come in. <laughs> Where'd it go? McEnroe's only had two winners his whole set. Sampras more than a dozen. Game, first set, Sampras. First set goes to Sampras, 6-2. And rather easily, too. Hey, a lot of shots all over the court. Tended to go for too much. And when you have the big shots, not only returning, but on your own service. I, I can't afford to have a bad game. <laughs> Down. That was what he's trying to accomplish right here, but it stayed up, and McEnroe closed quickly, got it before it got below the top of the net. Just long. Ball or two at him at a crucial time. Game Sampras. Yeah, uh, he had he had been in trouble. McEnroe was bunting back some good returns, and he did a pretty nice job on that one. But Sampras can still take the offensive. It's nice to be an all-around player. Yeah. Because if you're forcing a baseline, you can still respond. You can serve and volley. Yeah. Sampras didn't start out the <laughs> To get some of the best coaching from there. And again, I'm real glad that he changed his backhand because this is one of the best in the game already. It had no effect on anything. It was a fault. Here's another look at the backhand down the line on the return. All John could do is shake his head. Early preparation. Good contact. Made contact in front of the body. He really is. Here it comes. And John's got a veer looking for the ball down the line. See, he was planning, looking like he was going to go... Full stretch by McEnroe, right down the center. And again, you almost have to give him that one. It's perfectly struck. This is what it looks like coming right at you. Macro didn't get some good pace on this one because it went across Sampras. He would have been able to reach it. He just had too much pace. I think Sampras. Yeah. It didn't And McEnroe tried to climb all over the second serve, and he did a pretty good job of it. Sampras had time to hit this one, but Quiet, bagged please. it into the net, so. Okay. 
Good hands by McEnroe. Short backswing on the return. Set up nicely. And then this one really good. Not too big a swing. Just beat him into the open gap. You bagged me. He, of course, instrumental in Tracy Austin's great game. Yeah. Yeah. Doesn't get much on his first volley. No sting to it, not very deep. Gave Sampras plenty of time to set up and decide which way he wanted to go. There's the break. To be okay. Good hands by Sampras, but watch how quickly McEnroe gets onto the short one. He's up there before Sampras can recover. He doesn't have to do much with it, just don't miss it. But by the way, he moved it. Wide. Just a... <laughs> Two, this one has a lot of action on it, gets it pretty deep. Mac walks right into it. See, he started inside that baseline and the direction. Wide. Boy, you got to give McEnroe credit. Watch how deep this return comes. And then look at the touch volley. Not an easy one. Stabbed at it, directed it perfectly, and he's got his first break of the match to level at four all. Watch, what does he think of it? Another great return. They hit a very difficult first volley. Look where he makes it from the tee. I mean, that's how quickly it's coming back to him. And of course, that sets up. In sports this Saturday. Good play by McEnroe. 15 all. He made it. This gets the ball down as McEnroe comes in. Gets it down again. Now he guesses cross court. Watch him go real quickly the other way. Well, that's awfully good. Stretched out wide. Directs it down the line. Good volley by Sampras. The best he could do, but couldn't recover quickly. Game. Second set, Sampras, 6-4. Sampras wins the second set, 6-4. He won the first 6-2. One more game. He showed such utter formlessness at Wimbledon, losing their first round. Sabatini is a big story in Argentina right now. She claims she'll never be as big. How quickly he gets on this ball and directs it. 
not a big backswing. Uses the speed on. I'm saying, what are you talking about? <laughs> Watch how early he jumps for this one. Hangs. Air Sampras. Watch this. Talk about hang time. Quiet, please. I guess he didn't hurt his ankle earlier. <laughs> no. I was saying about McEnroe. won Philly this year indoors and a grass court tournament in Manchester. He can move. Yep. There will be little or no 30, back 15. swing on this one. Coming up right here, good disguise, holds it there and it just flicks it cross court. No way McEnroe can read it unless he guesses properly. See that rack was out in front the whole time, just pops the hand just a little bit. Directs it any way he wants. <laughs> On the dead run. Looping forehand cross court. See, Macro is parked on the left side here of this tournament. Cross quarters, bun it down the line. We'll take another look here. He gets there in time. Yeah, he was trying to go down the line. Now he's saying, well, why don't you just roll it cross court? It's a couple of inches higher right there where McEnroe was trying to guide that ball. And that's the way Sampras was going as well. Can't believe it. <laughs> 30 low. 30 low. To win the U.S. Open when it was played on three different surfaces. Is there anything Matt can do? Well, I think he's gonna hang in there and uh, just keep the pressure on Sampras and see if he can just get a break here or there and the, and the tide may turn. Thank you. Here's another look at that last point. This sets up the pass. John sort of ran through this forehand volley Hit a little bit flat. Didn't have much underspin on it. Looking, he was right on it. Can't believe he missed it. <laughs> Flowers. <laughs> this is how he broke the serve. Sampras chose to let that one go. I think he thought it was going to be Quiet, out. Please. He it must was, have. It was well inside. They've been out there. McEnroe wins the third set. 6-3. Sampras leads in sets 2-1. Back at the stadium at the USTA's National Tennis Center. Two sets to one, Sampras. Sampras serving. Fifteen love. Come on!
game to McEnroe. 15 love. 30, 15. 15. Looks Pretty like McEnroe's going to have no chance here. And a flick of the wrist gets that racket head through early. So he popped that wrist to get the racket head to go back cross court with it. Super Saturday has indeed been just that. Game center. This was going to be a tough volley for McEnroe, but it was makeable. But he had to stretch so much he couldn't control it. Actually, that was an easier one than a can play. And McEnroe. I should say. Put Sampras on the defensive with that overhead. Watch this on the dead run. Boy, he's loosened up his. Oh. What a oh. This is the big opportunity. He didn't choke either. It was aggressive. Just missed it, boy. That thing just snapped the top of the tape. McEnroe was standing there, but I don't think he could have handled it. When he gets in and stabs at this next Jeez. one, there's so much underspin that the ball hits and bounces into the net. Not that one. Right here. And it goes back towards the net. You can see Sampras try to figure out how to get there and Boy, make the please. shot and not touch the net or lose the point. He gets the ball out in front of the body, gets the racket hit in front. You see Mackner's got no hook. Watch how this racket pulls off of the ball. How soft. So you have to let that racket fall backwards. McEnroe's longtime coach is like magic. <laughs> Bully extends on this one. Cuts it right down the center line. Gentlemen, we appreciate you. Uh, this was a real good Please serve. It should have opened up the point for, for John. But look, he sent the volley right back to Pete Sampras, and Pete had a nice big goal swing at it. Also landed inside the service line, so that doesn't push the take him to get one by McEnroe. That may break points. Again, he gets out in front of this so he can go cross court.
McEnroe. McEnroe will get a look at the second one. Boy, Sampras stayed down. The Rocket, 16 aces. And the Rocket gets him to three match points. Aces for Sampras, 15 for McEnroe. And this is match points. Watch it if you can. Perfectly struck right down the tee. There's his reaction. One more time. What a thrill for that youngster.